Hello and welcome to BMNG Drive. I'm David N. Ark and today I thought it'd be fun if we hooked a camper up to various vehicles and threw it off the, uh, the, uh, the ramp here, the jump in the Swiss Alp map. So there you go. <laughs> Why not, right? <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's see if we can. I, I think the, the hardest problem we're going to have is just maintaining control. Although so far, we're actually doing okay. There's a little sway in the back. We're all right. Nice launch. Oh, here we go. We're going to land. I don't think this is going to go well at all. Ouch. I'm very curious to see which vehicle might be the best one to tow a camper and actually have the camper, you know, survive as best as it can. Which, looking at this, I'm not so sure uh, it's going to survive at all. All right, here we go. How about a Blue Buck stock car? There we go. Come on. Ah, uh, this is so hard to control. No. Well, we can ride the rail. Oh! Uh, okay. Evidently, there's some kind of a weird little glitch there in the rail. Ripped the chassis clean out of the car. Holy cow. All right. <laughs> Let's see. Whoo. <clears throat> Let's see if we can try that again. Maybe I'll just ease over the hill until we get started. Not peel out right away. Just give it a little ah man as soon as this car wants to go it gets away from me well we're gonna well come on oh man oh do we clear the trees no no we do not <laughs> sorry well <clears throat> all right that didn't really go so well although we are taking a nice little slide in the snow huh All right, let's try this again. I'm just gonna aim for the white line in the middle, just gently. Come on, quit swaying, quit swaying. No, 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 no. Oh my gosh. Once it starts going back and forth, man, there's just no controlling it. Now, flying through the air, slow it down a little bit. Okay, well, technically, I mean, the camper's upside down and I mean, it seems to be in pretty good shape, so that's not, well. All right, it was in good shape until we fell off the edge. Ah, uh, shoot. All right, how about this? What if we try an off-road um, van? I, I, now I can't remember. <laughs> I can't remember the series. H series? D series? Yeah, H series, all right. There we go. Oh, beautiful. Nice launch. Oh, everything looks good. Look at that. Oh, oh, landing on, well, I was going to say all fours, landing on all six. All right, well, we've lost a wheel. Things are, oh, busted up, and we ran into the wall. All right, we got to try that again. All right, here we go. H-Series off-road van. Heading down the Swiss Alps ramp one more time. No, 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 no. Come on, come on. Just keep going straight. Just keep going straight. Oh, look at that. That really does have a very nice launch. Oh, this is not going to go well. Our trailer has decidedly turned over to the side anyway. The van managed to land perfectly upright. The van's like, yeah, we're good. Hey, check it out, though. Oh, well, okay. There's a wall there. But um, look at the camper, though. The camper itself is actually in pretty good... Uh, well, okay. I'm going to use the term, oh, well, all right, very loosely. But, I mean, it's in, it's in decent shape. I mean, it's still recognizable as a camper, as it were, right? Maybe? Maybe not. All right, let's just go a little crazy, and we're going to try the bolide, and we're just going to, you know, let's go with first some 80s sports car goodness, towing a camper, because, you know, that's what we all did in the 80s. Whoa, that's not easy to control, and 
Off the edge we go. Huh. All right. <clears throat> well, the camper itself, the top part anyway, did a pretty good job of keeping itself together while it slid down off the uh, ramp there. Of course, it's in a gazillion pieces now, so that's not going to work. All right. Let's try this again. Once again, I have to try to ease the car down the hill. I don't know. There's a delicate balance between letting the car do its thing and trying to keep the trailer from undulating. Ah, man. Ah, the trailer pulled my back end away from me and I just drove head first into the wall. Oh, here we go. How about grind the rail a little bit? <laughs> the camper's like, hey, I'm coming along for the ride. Oh, that is not good. Okay, maybe my problem is my angle. Maybe if I look down from the top. Okay, this is a little easier to control so far. Nope. Man, it gets to that same point, kind of where the ramp starts to curve the other direction, and I just lose it. I cannot control the thing. Although, it is making for some really, really cool crashes, that's for sure. Oh, and we've got fire. <laughs> oh, yeah. Fuel tank is on fire. And we have a bouncing bathtub. That's about right. Okay, here we go. How about a D-Series Beast? That's right, this is the Beast. Oh, look at this. This is great. It's pulling it along. There's very little waver. In fact, I'm not even sure there is waver. Oh, I... Okay, wasn't expecting... Ouch! All right, I wasn't expecting the front end of this vehicle to just completely do a nosedive as soon as it left the uh, ramp. I mean, that just... Uh, there's no other word for it. Holy cow. All right. Ah... <sighs> Okay, let's get this thing set back up, reconnected. Come on, can you can you get it from there? Yeah, you can. You're such a good little trailer. All right, here we go. Beast mode 101, or technically 102. I don't know. Take two. Anyway, we're in beast mode, heading down the ramp in the Swiss Alps. Oh, look at that! It is just perfectly in line. Everything looks good. Oh, there's a little weird thing there. Nope. That nosedive, man. It just goes straight down. And for whatever crazy reason, it definitely wants to veer off to the left. Oh. No camping for you this weekend. Ouch. We got wheels bouncing, rolling, flying by. Oh, speaking of wheels flying by. Hey. Okay. <laughs> and there's the other one rolling away. <laughs> That's, uh. So one thing that I hadn't considered, oh, what if we just send the camper itself? No cars attached. Uh, I did uh, raise the gear there, the, the, I don't know, whatever you want to call it, or technically lowered it, I guess. Look at that. This is the best one we've had so far. Oh, that's a nice, gentle landing. Oh, no, no, no. Of course, I can't steer it. So, I mean, you're just literally throwing it over the edge and hoping that uh, gravity and friction run its course. Oh. Okay, okay. We got we to gotta try this again. Camper only. All right, here we go. Camper, look at the sparks are flying. There we go. Camper only. <laughs> Sounds like a train chucking down to the ramp. Oh, that little lip keeps us in line. Oh, yeah, look at that. That's a beautiful takeoff. Man, if we could just get over to the left just a little bit more, I think this thing would make it all the way to the sand pit. That is awesome. Oh, my gosh. Man, well, I don't know. What do you think? Let me know down in the comments section below. Got any questions, problems, suggestions, horror stories? Feel free to put those down in the comments section as well. Thank you so much to War Heroes Gaming, Gamer Gall, and Mr. Spooky7 for supporting me on Patreon. And most of all, thank you for taking time out of your day to check out 
another one of David and Ark's goofy video ideas here in Beam NG. <laughs> it really does. It means so much to me that you guys are enjoying the videos, checking them out, watching them. So thank you very, very much. Hey, if you liked it, subscribe, like, share, all that kind of good stuff. And if not, that's cool too. Thanks for watching.